Greetings, and thanks for taking a moment to listen to our message. First of all, I hope all are staying safe, and I know you're staying strong during this COVID-19 event. Remember, April is Sexual Assault Awareness and Prevention Month, and I know we're halfway through the month, and COVID-19 has hindered our ability to gather for our annual Sexual Assault Awareness event. However, it has not stopped our efforts to end sexual assault. We all know as guardsmen that we must combat the evils of sexual assault. It will not be tolerated in our formations. Our best, brightest, and bravest join the guard for all the right reasons, to serve their state and country, and to protect and defend the freedoms we enjoy in our American way of life. It takes strong leaders, strong soldiers, and airmen to ensure sexual assault is not tolerated across our force. Every service member at every level must know understand and adhere to Army and Air Force values and standards of behavior. We all must understand our part in stopping this crime. Know when and where to intervene. Do your part. You have to act. If you see a crime or inappropriate behavior unfolding, have the courage to step in and prevent it. It is paramount our service members know resources are available 24-7, 365 days a year. So on behalf of the command team, never forget, our organization is a team, but it's also a family. So I ask, would you treat your family member in an undignified way? No, you wouldn't. So the same applies for our team. In order for the North Carolina National Guard to fight our enemies, whether they are viruses or threats on the battlefield, we must be able to rely on each teammate. Sexual assault has no place on our team. Again, I want all to stay safe and remain strong, like I know North Carolina National Guard soldiers and airmen are. And remember, we must remain an always ready team.